I'm going to show you how to use a GPS device with a Promethean interactive whiteboard. Now I'm going to make a track using this Garmin GPS. When I arrive at an area of interest, I'll create a waypoint. And how you create a waypoint is by doing this. To create a waypoint, I hold down the cursor button. I press OK, and there is number 12, the waypoint. Back in the interactive classroom, I'm going to use a whiteboard. You can use your fingers to zoom in and out, and move the screen around. If you don't know what an interactive whiteboard is, it's basically a giant iPad. <laughs> now I'm going to co connect the GPS to the whiteboard via the USB. Now that we've connected the GPS to the whiteboard, I'm going to import the, G the track to Google Earth. Now that we've imported the data onto the interactive whiteboard, we can look at the track on Google Earth. Now I'm going to export this to the desktop so that I can share this with other people as a KMZ file. Now I've saved it to the desktop, I open up the KMZ file and it should open up Google Earth again, but with the trip. Now on Active Inspire, I am going to insert a link, the, the track that we made earlier. So I select the KMZ file, it's an image icon, store it in the flip chart, and there it is. All you have to do is click it once, and blam, Google Earth comes up, and there's your track. On this Android smartphone, I can use an app called My Tracks. You can record a track and then you can send it to Google Maps, like so. Now I'm going to view the track I just made on the Android smartphone. So I go into Google, sign in, go to Google Maps then to my maps, I'll try the latest map I've made, this one here. So I go to links, right to the right, and select the link, copy it, then I paste it in a certain place, this area to be precise. I paste the link, set how I want it to look, and there it is on the desktop, and if I press it, it should appear.